Yeah, 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 I know what happened last episode. I was there. You was there too. You saw me. Well, maybe you should have made the trial. Maybe you should have made the trial better. I'm sitting there clicking over and over again. We all know it's Makan. Why did, why did you even do that? This stupid ass despair disease. That, isn't that cheating? Do you have any sense of morality? No, of course not. Because you're Monokuma. Look at your mouth. Like, bro. Look at his mouth. Why don't you have no lip right here? It's all jaw. Like, this nigga don't have no lip except when he turned white. Shouldn't that be opposite? No racial, no racial, no racial, no racial, no racial, no racial. Look, relax, okay? Let's just get through this trial and move on. Everybody on my head last episode because I got mad. I mean, I'll see you at the end. My fault, y'all. What? Good job, welcome back, A, hey, to some more. Two, goodbye despair. I know what I said last time, but I and I and I doubly know y'all are extremely surprised to see this game back so soon. But like I said, if I'm gonna enjoy this, I just gotta keep the homies over at. Look, the homies sent me this letter as well. Wow. Thank y'all so much for the for the uh, share. Yo, bro. It's been a pleasure. We had a great era on the channel. I apologize about your neck. It seems like it recovered properly though, right? Okay, all right, all right, bro. Well, I'll see you in the afterlife. Live a good life. I hope I see you there. Quit talking so much trash, I might not. You know what I mean? All right, so from what I remember last time we was here, Makan's... Makan just twisted, bro. But I guess she had a memory, and the despair disease reminded her who she used to be. It reminded her of the future somebodies who are also the world enders. She told us that Monokuma and Manomi work for them, or with them, Let's just let's just try and piece it together as this as this trial ends. <clears throat> <sighs> that doesn't make me happy at all. Her whole voice has changed. I didn't even care last episode. She got a whole new voice, bro. It just fills me with despair. You guys accepted my past self, but not my present self. That's well. That applies to you all as well. Memories of people, memories of events, whatever memory it is. Losing memories are... Do you understand? Like losing your personal identity. Memory is the most important component in building a person. Don't you think? Losing our memories makes us shadows of the past. Don't you think? Hey. I don't know what you're trying to say, but in the end, it always leads back to that story. That story about our stolen school lives. Hey, hey! So, it was true all along? Our memories were taken away? Damn it! If it wasn't true, we wouldn't be suffering this much. <sighs> well, why don't you just take your sweet time and remember at your own pace? Oh, oh Monokuma! I think I stressed the, the A instead of the... Ooh. Is it all right for you to start now? Yes, indeed. Punishment time? Damn it. Why? Makan, why does it have to end like this? This is too pointless. This, this too much. Now then, I prepared a very special punishment. For the ultimate nurse, Mikan Sumiki. 
so it's over. It's really... Now I can go to my beloved, who always forgives me. Goodbye. I hope she I hope he forgives that, them bangs. I can finally see them. Mm, forgive your barber. Please forgive me, the one who's going to die with the hope of fighting. Goodbye. Let's give it everything. Goodbye. Y'all told me this... Y'all told me this execution is underwhelming as well, so... Here goes nothing. And just in case they try and hit me with a copyright during the worst trial ever... PG mute the track. <laughs> Ain't even no music playing. Bye bye ouchies. Alright. You said call the ouchies? The singer? Alright, bro. And she still kind of got to look sexy. Like she look she got to look like she riding the tip. She got to look like she on somebody fist. Bro. Bro, that's what we're all trying to do is get out of here. What was that? Put me Don't put me on the fist though. But get me out of here. She didn't even die. Bro, we did <laughs> Bro, she won. <laughs> it's finished. Thank God. But is it really finished? I like this track too when they play this music. The killer who killed Ibuki Miyota and Hiyoko Sayonji was Makan Sumiki. And she's been saved. She apparently committed her crime because she was afflicted by the despair disease. So what? What's finished? Nobody wanted it to end this way. Let me ask. Who was that Makan from earlier? Was that her true form? Or is that itself a symptom of the despair disease? Damn it. It doesn't matter either way. If she ended up like that just from remembering, then all along, Makan was never worth being a symbol of hope. What? Even if her words were influenced by the despair disease. If the disease turned her into that. If she lost herself to a simple disease. She was definitely unworthy of being a symbol of hope. Isn't that right? So. Let's just move on. <laughs> Come on. Let's take all this despair and change it into hope. Please wait. That's Im that is impossible. Uh. I mean. I thought we were friends this whole time, but even so. Like a house of cards collapsing in an instant. In the end, our friend we thought we knew ended up showing us a completely different side of herself. Then she vanished from our sight, leaving behind only her malice toward us. And now, there's no way we can just move on or try to have a clear-cut attitude about these feelings. It's clearly impossible. Damn it! It would have been so much easier if she was the traitor too. Wrong! Too bad! That's not the case. Makan was not the traitor. Come on! The traitor is still alive. As proof, see how fine Monami looks right now? <sighs> I'm not fine at all. Hmm? But if the traitor died, she wouldn't be this calm, right? I mean, you're both pawns of the future foundation, so you guys are like two hearts beating as one, right? You fiend. What does that make you, fiend? You did say that you're different than Monami. Phew. Who cares about who I am? More importantly, I'm tired. The drama just kept going and going. I didn't even have time to eat my black bean right eye. What? During the break. What? Hey! Your right eye is made out of black beans? Hey, hey! Wait, now's not the time to focus on that. What are you trying to say? Hey, um... You know, 
isn't it sad that life has its oh isn't it sad that life has its ups and downs it's fun because downs come after ups but if life was full of downs wouldn't it get boring <laughs> so in order to help you guys feel better i've prepared a special event special event <laughs> Head over to the first island's beach. An old friend will be waiting there. Nekamaru. Old friend? Could it be Nekamaru? Hey. Is it? It is, isn't it? Nekamaru was safe after all? Hmm. Um, safe? How should I say this? Hmm. <laughs> I knew it. I knew that crazy bastard Nekamaru would come back to us in one piece. <laughs> awesome! We're starting to see the light of hope! Um... The light of hope? Um... I am happy about Nekomaru returning to us, but... But I... So just as I thought... Three of our friends just died. So I honestly cannot be happy. Hmm... Miss Sonia... However... Even so, I am still happy! If Nekomaru is safe, I am truly happy! Fine. If you are happy, you should honestly greet him with open arms. Perhaps those who have been taken from us would do the same if they still lived. Huh. Hey, Supreme Overlord of Who Gives a Shit, that line doesn't suit you at all. Silence. I shall crush you into the dust! Um... Ibuki, Hiyoko, Mikan... Can you hear us? If you are unhappy, I apologize. However, please forgive me for right now. I want to warmly welcome Nekamaru when he returns to us. You don't have to worry, Sonya. I'm sure your feelings are reaching them. Right? Then let's all go greet Nekamaru. Let's make it grand, even for those who have died. <laughs> Like, come on, man. We just... Now, that, that was her That was her guy. That was her guy. Huh? What the heck? Do I still have the after effects of that disease? <laughs> I don't get this at all. A -a Akane. All right. Let's go! Yeah, you're right. Let's get up out of here, then. Nekamaru's coming back. When we heard that... We were unable to contain our excitement as we jumped into the elevator. Uh -oh. Man! What are you about to tell us? Yo! Yo! What are you about to tell me? Tell me now. I need it on auto mode while I choke you out. I'm Jeez, they're so impatient. Out. Didn't they learn to stick around until others have finished? Say it out loud. Say it out loud! Um... What does that mean? Say it! Hey! You, you're plotting something again, aren't you? What are you plotting? No way! I was just trying to properly explain everything to them. Say it! Say it! Including Nekomaru's... Hmm? What did you do to his body? <laughs> did he get took? Under your control? It's their fault for not sticking around until I- Fight! <laughs> he tried to fight what back! Did you see him- <laughs> He just see him trying to do a, a, a forward air? I mean, if I didn't do that, there's no way I could have saved someone who was that close to death. So it just couldn't be helped. <laughs> what did you do to him? We gotta get to the beach! Oh, we're here. No, no, no. We gotta get to the beach. As soon as we exited the elevator, we started running. Hurry! To the beach on the first island! Alright! Let's haul ass! Alright. Even though our minds were completely exhausted, strangely enough, our bodies felt light. Without stopping for anything, we kept right on running toward the beach on the first island. What did he do to Nekomaru? Body? He probably ain't got no more muscles, huh? Where... Where in the world is Nekomaru? Hey! Nekomaru! Show yourself! Listen! We have come to pick you up! Please hurry up and come out of hiding! We raised our voices. 
We looked around the area. We raised our voices again. We looked around the area again. And so on and so on forth. We kept looking for him, but... Hey, hey! What, what the hell, man? He's nowhere to be found! Damn it! Could it be? Did we get false info from Monokuma again? And that's when it happened. We heard a familiar voice echo throughout the beach. <laughs> what happened? Were y'all looking for me? Could it be? Th that voice! With high hopes in our hearts, we turned toward the direction of the voice. And then... We saw something truly unbelievable. Huh? What the? Is this the thumbnail? Bro, is it the... Okay, potentially. Yo! I've kept you waiting. Hey, what's going on? Perhaps you don't remember my face since we haven't seen each other in a while. What are we looking at, y'all? That's pretty sad, you know? That's too much! <laughs> Can we see him? Um, who are you? Huh? You too? What's going on? Bro. If you're messing with me, I'll stop doing it to you. Whoa. Um, Nekomaru? Haven't you noticed it yourself? What do you mean, noticed? Oh, you mean this body? <laughs> this is nothing! This body? The name's Nekomaru Nidai! I've been reborn in the rivers of hell! Got the nerve that still has his army whistle, like... He looked like Dr. Robotnik, he looked like doggone Cyborg, uh, the Tin Man from out from Wonderland, like, a, he looked like Akuma from Street Fighter, a little Blanca-ish, he looked like a recyclable, like, uh, he, he can't, he can't be the one of the last people to live looking like this. <laughs> and if he is, Danganronpa is just, they... I'm glad he's alive, but like, what are we really looking at right now? Look at his beard, bro. And they gonna end it like... Oh, wow. I'm not counting the days or the time when I'm doing my free time. But it said nine days left. We really lost three people just now. Wow. Alright, well let's let's get through the filler of trying to trying to see more drama happen. Nurse's apron, that's beautiful. I'm gonna give that to Kaizuchi Soda because he's a freak leak. We were hoping things would progress smoothly. That's right, a common ordinary progression would have been just fine. Like, for example, the enemy's lair crumbling right after you defeat the final boss, or your dead friend suddenly reappearing. It would have been just fine if these if things had progressed like that. That's the kind of old school progression we were hoping for. Not this unreasonable turn of events. Somebody signed me up for a voice acting gig like Nekomaru Nidai! I've been reborn in the rivers of hell! Calm it down, bro. Nekomaru? Is that you? <laughs> no matter how you look at it, I'm still me. Do you got a phallus? Cause if I lose my phallus. You might as well just put a plug, bro. I need to smash, bro. No matter how we look at it, this isn't you at all. Look at him. <laughs> no, hold up. That's kind of clean. He look clean right there, though. He make a cool little hero. Jeez, you guys are a strange lot. You all have such big white eyes. <laughs> no, perhaps you've all fallen in love with this metallic body of mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what you want to say just by looking in your eyes. Then again, I am a former team manager. And guess what? I don't even have butt cheeks this time. I don't have this shit no more. No, sir. No shit. No shit. Yeah. Mm. 
What happened? You look like you've seen a ghost or something. Ooh. Hey, man. Don't go scaring Miss Sonya with that strange-ass mask. As he raised his stammering voice, Kaizuchi grabbed onto Nekamaru's head and... I already know. Come on. Take it off. Ow. 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 Oh. St stop it. Stop it! Hey, hey. Huh? Why won't it come off? Wait. What? Are you freaking kidding me? It's not just for show, it's PURE ELECTRICITY! I've been reborn. <laughs> I look at Akane like, if you're seriously Nekamaru, Damn it. that's my fault, right? You ended up getting a body like that, and it's all my fault, right? S sorry. So sorry, Nekamaru. I... I don't know how to apologize for this. <laughs> don't worry about it! A lot of stuff happens when you're alive. Are you serious? You're to a beat! Is this really okay? <laughs> you keep sweating the small stuff, you're gonna get a in and up with more gray hairs! Hey, hey! C commenting on every little thing he does is a waste of time! <laughs> but you're really Nekomaru, right? You came back for us. Right? That's right! <laughs> Yo, he's still boo booing, bruh. I resurrected from the depths of hell in shining silver! You... How are you even okay with that? It doesn't even compare to my eye patch. How can you accept that body? Oh! It's better to just be alive. Huh? Huh? It's better to just be alive. Hey, don't you agree? If I'm alive, I can still talk to you all. If I'm alive, I can still fight. Show some spirit! It doesn't matter what happens to my body! Not one bit! Amazing! You, you're amazing! Nekomaru was brimming with hope! Ugh, Nekomaru, I'm feeling that! It's better to just be alive. I do understand what Nekamaru was saying, but no matter how we make sense of this, it's just too weird. This isn't a novel or a movie. This is reality. Can something this unexplainable really be allowed to happen? No. Instead, why did this happen? Um. Anyway, I'm glad. That's fine, right? Right? Nekomaru definitely came back to us. What's this? My, my! Am I? <laughs> yeah. Why is Nekomaru a robot? Unfortunately, it was truly difficult to save Nekomaru from the jaws of death. But they don't call me the Psycho Pop Magician for nothing. Oh my goodness! <clears throat> Such, Such a, a wonderful before and after! after has okay, he got me with that line. He shut me up with that line. He did that. <laughs> it appears to be a little too dramatic. Thanks to that, I'm getting stabbed by all these envious stares. Hey, hey! If you're really a robot, what's going on with your thought process? Is that a program too? Then what happened to the other stuff like your self-awareness and... <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you that it doesn't matter? No matter what shape or form I take, I am Nekomaru Nidai! Is he... Is he going to power through the rest of his life with his new abilities? Hmm... Th that kind of reaction, it looks like you really are self-aware. <gasps> that means this technology is insane! I've never seen or heard of anything like this before! Phew. What the commoner considers advanced is not much of an advancement. If you think advancements exist in colleges and laboratories, that's a huge misunderstanding. 
<laughs> the real advancements exist in the place where you can pass on that talent. Hey, hey. And, 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 and you're saying that's you? Were you really that amazing? You. Stop admiring him. You stupid stuffed toy. Don't go screwing with people's bodies like that. What? Uh, uh, hold on. If you harm Monokuma, you're going to... <laughs> you intend to defy me yet again? You're quite the barbarian. Disappear! <laughs> this time, you will definitely fall prey to my Monokuma bazooka. Why are you doing this, Akane? Nekomaru is happy. And you gonna jump in the mix again, Neku? Once again, the world shook and turned stark white. As if the surrounding environment and all sound was blown away by the impact. Turning everything completely white. And within that whiteness, I heard that voice yet again. Uh, uh, Ugh, he ate that. Ugh. Didn't face me at all. Ugh. Check it out. I'm intact. I have no injuries at all. Hey, hey. Are you fucking serious? He took that blast and doesn't even have a single scratch. <gasps> oh, awesome. He's seriously a robot. <gasps> hey, can you let me disassemble you? Can Can you let me disassemble you and, and show me your insides? <laughs> These stuff nuts is kind of lit. <laughs> if I get disassembled, I'll end up dying. By the way, uh, I suppose I should fill you in. Even though he's a robot now, if Nekomaru was killed, it's still going to count as murder, okay? Of course. It's possible that Nekomaru might kill someone instead. <laughs> Don't say such foolish things. That will never happen. <laughs> well, with all that in mind, you guys enjoy the killing school trip together. Let's get along. Once again, I hope we can all get along. It's impossible. It's gonna be a while before I can mentally process this. Um. Um, will Nekomaru never return to his original form? If that is the case, it is a burden for Nekomaru. Hey, hey, it's not like I can I came back as a monster. Just a robot now, you know? Mm. I'm sorry. I can't really see a difference. That's fucked up. Uh-huh. Well, just consider this a little promotion. By making a robot one of the main characters, a genuine mystery is transformed into a sci-fi mystery. Mm. And the hard-boiled is transformed into cyberpunk. <laughs> You're totally destroying the genres! <laughs> oh well, who cares? As long as it's fun, it's totally fine! <laughs> as I listened to Monokuma's boisterous laugh, once again I was forced to accept this island is not the day-to-day -day world I know. It's a mad world where the strange is accepted as normal. Causes, reasoning, circumstances, foreshadowing, these things don't apply here at all. That's what it means to live in a mad world. Whenever I hear the word mad word, I think of Gears of War. Y'all remember when, when they dropped Gears of War, was it 3? And they had that song for the trailer? That tra that was probably the best time for Gears of War. Not about, I, didn't even, I didn't even care that they dropped Gears 5, bro. The next morning, we gathered at the hotel restaurant like we always do. Man, the food today was awesome as usual. <laughs> As always, you sure to eat a lot. I feel relaxed just by looking at you. It's impossible not to worry about it. Can y'all put that candle out in the back? No matter what, this feels really strange. It's not something I'll get used to easily. Hey, hey. Anyway, what are you gonna do, Mechamaru? Mechamaru? You're used to him already? <gasps> What am I gonna do? Hmm. For food, do you need, like, oil? Hey, hey. Regular? Premium? Chiaki is that one, bro. 
you see how she already accepted him normalized him with a nickname and is now trying to support him sustain him regular premium she about to go to the store and get it for him get you a chiaki bro well nah he doesn't need oil since he said he's pure electricity maybe he's battery powered or something i can totally eat normal food especially rice dishes i can't keep my eyes off them <laughs> however i've been feeling a little down today so i don't have much of an appetite all right are you malfunctioning if you show me your insides i can fix you up you know <laughs> he pulled it out what did he just booboo out probably two duracells um <laughs> Oh gosh. <laughs> what? So you're here too? Sorry. Nah, I'm sorry. I should know my place and not speak out of turn when everyone's gathered together like this. However, I just wanted to make sure I spoke to you about what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday? Hmm. That person Makan called her beloved. I can't help thinking about that, and it won't get out of my head. What? <sighs> Am I just a coward for worrying about that? Let me tell you this. <clears throat> it crossed my mind as well, but based on how she phrased it. So this is the end. This is really... Now I can go to my beloved and be forgiven. I can finally see my beloved. Please forgive me as my hopes of finally seeing you die with me! The f This too must be the will of causality. It was as if she was speaking to an entity that does not exist in this world. Whenever I do Gundam voice, I think of Caleb City. <laughs> Caleb would smash his voice. Then there's nothing to worry about. Fine. More importantly, we should be thinking about the future foundation, our enemy. If that fearsome organization known as World Ender is truly responsible for our imprisonment, if you glitch, you will die! Then investigating who's behind that organization is our top priority. The future foundation. Hmm. That word future. Does it have anything to do with that ancient ruin? I mean, there's no doubt that that symbol on the door was the ancient ruin. That, this, that that symbol on the door to the ancient ruin was the Japanese word for future. That's the case. It might be better if we investigate the ancient ruins again later. However, the more I think about it, the less it make the less sense it makes. Why would an organization that's secretly plotting to end the world make us suffer like this? They went to a lot of trouble to abduct us and bring us to this island. Hmm. Not only that, they took away several years worth of memories of our lives at Hope's Peak Academy for reasons that are also unknown. Future Foundation! Yo, chill. World Ender! Ha! Impossible! There's obviously something wrong with you if you believe in something so unrealistic. Hey, hey! You're one to talk. But. What we should be most concerned about. As it relates to the Future Foundation... Isn't that right? ...is the traitor from the Future Foundation that's hiding among us. Hey. I wonder who it is. The true identity of the Outsider hiding among us and trying to ensnare us. I won't be fooled! Nikito's obviously the most suspicious, though. <laughs> Even a childish organization blathering about ending the world wouldn't accept someone like me. Man. Nobody wants a worthless human like me to join the group. <laughs> you guys should know that feeling well, right? Golly, that's sad. This dude just boob on himself every episode. And that's the reason why you're not the traitor? I don't understand your theory at all. Huh? Then, who do you think is the most suspicious? It's obvious. I nominate Hajime. What the? Bro, what's up with you, dude? Huh? Wow. Well, isn't it normal to doubt the most unlikely candidate? <laughs> yeah. Hey. Not just that. 
you're the only one here who still doesn't know what ultimate talent you possess. If we're basing this on an outsider hiding among a group of ultimates, Hajime should be doubted right away. I'm not even mad at that reasoning, but what's up? That's exactly how a fight with me would go. We gonna square up and then we gonna realize how ridiculous we look and we just gonna dance it out. Then Hajime's the tra Hajime's the traitor. Uh, of course not. What are you even saying? You shouldn't raise your voice like that. We might become even more suspicious of you, you know? Th this is obviously your fault. Shut it down. Stop fighting. <laughs> Don't you think fighting with ourselves like this is Monokuma's trap? Th th that, that might be true, but... Alright. I'll handle this. Just leave this matter to me. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> to eliminate this tense atmosphere, allow me to present to you my new function that I discovered last night. N new function? <gasps> Don't tell me. Is it flight? C can you fly? No. It's not a conventional function like that. It's far more practical than novel! Now then, let's go! What is that coming out of his eyeballs, y'all? What is that, soup? Sewage? Piss? Huh? Nekomaru is crying! No! Hardly! Not crying. My right eye dispenses cola, and my left eye dispenses Ruby's tea. Behold! This might be the thumbnail for real. Are you kidding me? What are you, a soda fountain? Damn it! I know we'll be here all day if we keep commenting on every little thing you do. Don't fuck with me. But what me. the hell was Monokuma thinking, giving you a function like that? You're so evil. That guy. He's definitely fooling around. Monokuma's just toying with other people's bodies. <laughs> I too was modified by Monokuma, so I totally understand how Nekomaru feels. <laughs> but don't be depressed. You'll get used to it. It's surprising how quickly you'll get used to it. I'll beat you up. Don't go button in our conversation all of a sudden. I'll kill you until you die from it, you stupid rabbit. <laughs> It's an extremely violent thing to say to someone. <laughs> you showing up at this time means you come to tell us you've defeated another mono beast. Ta-da! You're correct. Thank you. Let's get to the island. <laughs> Once again, you can visit a new island, so please take this opportunity to get along with everyone. I ain't going. What a drag. <laughs> Even if we go to the new island, it's not like we're gonna find a way to escape this place, right? You are right. Rather, I feel as though the opportunity to kill increases every time we go to a new island. So, it might be best if we don't, if we do not go. I renounce you! I don't know what you're planning, fiend, but we're not going to fall for it. That's a misunderstanding. I was just... Lame. Oh, jeez. How annoying. Unbelievable. Just stay back and leave the rest to your big brother. I'll give you an example of how to lure these guys to you, little sis. Hey. What are you doing? You're acting like we're allies or something. Oh, gosh. I don't need to see Monami crotch, and then they gonna put it full screen on me, F11 on me. You to stay back. What does that say? Do say. This technique, it's impossible to defend against it or evade it. Do Run. say. There! Now that I've mopped up the annoying one. Special bleeding service! Okay, since you guys are feeling down in the dumps, make you guys so excited your noses will bleed compared to the earlier investigations 
I've prepared a special treat that's completely different than before. Um, treat? Nice! Oh, you took the bait? <laughs> I guess it's true. If you want to get a shut-in out of the room, carrots work the best. <gasps> Who the f*** cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the treat is. <laughs> it's an amazing treat. Don't wet your pants. Well, it's okay if you do, just don't spray it on me. I've prepared a bunch of stuff you guys might find interesting on the new island. Miracle! Such as... Clues about the future foundation. Huh? <laughs> Such as... Parts that may be useful for making a ship. You serious? Are you for real? News. And also, your student profiles from your time at Hope's Peak Academy. Huh? So, do your best to explore. Take care. We gotta go. Ain't no, ain't, ain't no telling. Like we gotta go. Hey, hey. What should we do? You know, right? Uh, our only option is to go. Obviously, we might be able to go home if we have ship parts. Yep. I plan to go too. If there are clues about the future foundation, we need to make sure we see them. Hajime. What about you, Hajime? Of course you're going, right? If you look at your student profile, you might be able to find out what your shining talent is. <laughs> it's a chance for you to clear any suspicions, right? What suspicions? I don't think anybody here doubts me. I just smashed that trial last episode. Alone. <laughs> Ah, uh, I see. But if there's a clue about my talent, I want to know what it is. The reason Hope's Peak Academy chose me, the talent I possess, these things matter to me. There's no way I'm not worried about it. It seems you've all prepared yourself for the worst. I'm starting to get pumped up. That means we're gonna go, right? I. If everyone is going. I shall accompany you as well. Hmm. But there's also a possibility that Monokuma set a trap. We should be careful where we step. I can't stop thinking about that ancient ruin that might hold clues about the future foundation. But we should start exploring the new island. Say less, we gone. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll go outside. But let me check my dog real quick. What is my dog's name? Usami? Did you not eat it all? Whatever. Animal walk there, just so that my dog can level up a bit. Yeah, 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 the mono beast that was blocking this bridge has disappeared all of a sudden. I've been wondering this for a while, but how is something as pathetic as Monami able to defeat a mono beast? Nah, it'd just be a waste of time to think about something like that. You know Monami is controlling them, and she being controlled herself. It's useless to think about things that are a waste of time. I've learned that much during my time here. I've learned that much during my time here. That's how that line was supposed to be delivered. I got y'all. As I walked across the bridge, I started to see the scenery on the new island on the other side. Is this an amusement park? I don't know what my thumbnail gonna be. I think it has to be Nekamaru, but bruh, look at this. Horror house. You know we gotta go up in there. You, you know who's gonna be in horror house? Poised, physical gamers, um, myself. John Wolf, <laughs> just all the homies, just in the whorehouse. It's like this whole island is one giant amusement park. It looks fun. 
amazing, exciting, thrilling. That just makes it look even creepier. A little bit. I'm ready to explore, though. Uh, horror House, first on the list. It used to be named Osami House. Look at that. Golly. There's a creepy looking building that doesn't seem like it belongs in an amusement park. Is this supposed to be a haunted house? Um. I don't really understand it, but this island certainly feels festive. Perhaps. If Hiyoki and Ibuki were here, they would have definitely enjoyed this. It's alright, it's alright. I don't like this. What the hell is wrong with this island? Why is this here when they're forcing us to kill each other? Dumbass! This is in such bad taste. Can we go inside or... Shatimi, look! Is this where my dog left when she left my Tamagashi? The sign at the top of the building definitely says Horror House, but... It's like... Whatever building used to be here was converted into a haunted house or something. Aww... This used to be her house. Ever since you took away my magic stick, Monokuma has been doing whatever he pleases. I've been reduced to the role of an unwanted child. My influence is weaker than it's ever been. And not just that, look what he did to my house. <laughs> this is too much. There's nothing good about this at all. If this keeps up, history will remember me as the greatest character to ever become a one-shot punchline! Uh, Ajime, you were here? You didn't notice until now. <laughs> How terrible of me as your teacher to cry in front of one of my students. Yo, that haunted house over there. Is that your house? It was. But Monokuma kept bullying me and it ended up like this. Uh, it was supposed to be cute. My house was supposed to be cute. Uh, you can't. I understand that you're interested, but you cannot go inside. Even teachers have a private side that their students aren't allowed to see. Um. Also, you're a boy of a certain age. If you come inside, I'll make sure I leave the door open halfway, otherwise my mommy won't shut up about it. Okay, so they are adults. <laughs> what am I saying? It's just a what if scenario, okay? <laughs> anyway, this is Monami's house, and it's safe to say that we're not allowed inside. So it's a waste of time to stay here any longer. I should hurry and go somewhere else. Goodbye. The amusement park's castle. It's mouse themed. Look at that mouse. You know they were trying to avoid as much copyright as possible. There's a lot of different things I could say about this building. But I probably shouldn't say anything at all. Yo, move! Well, what? Mice are the only thing I can't handle. Yo, who cares? You too? You don't like mice either? No. Well, we're siblings after all. <laughs> yeah. No! Not mice! I don't like them! Mouse. Not mice! They're gonna shoot through my ears! What a couple of loud mouths. I feel like my stress level just keeps rising around them. What, what's good, homies? Oh my. This building is full of dangerous areas. I feel like I should say something about it. Wow, what a coincidence. I was just thinking the same thing. <gasps> well, no matter how fancy it is, it's got nothing on Miss Sonya's castle. After all, she's the real deal. Miss Sonya is a 100% pure princess who lives in a 100% pure castle. Ugh. Don't talk so confidently about a castle you've never seen before. That shit could look like, uh, a, a straight straw hut. Hey, I was just wondering. You! Is a mere human going to offer his opinion to me, an overlord? Fascinating. <laughs> Fascinating, you fiend. If you 
flinch, you will die! I'll play your game, you rogue. Come, tell me. Try to satisfy my four dark divas of destruction! That's right. Yo, those hamsters could probably pass for mice, right? So maybe you can defeat Monokuma and Monami with your hamsters. How pitiful. I already told you. Hamsters are merely their temporary form. A fiend like you is incapable of, ima of imagining what would happen once they shed their transient guises. <laughs> Ignorance is horrendous. That's why it's only interesting to converse with humans once in a while. He gave some roundabout excuse that makes no sense. But my guess is he doesn't want to put them in danger. <laughs> Did this dude just beep at me, bro? Yo, are you okay? <laughs> There's a strange mechanical sound coming from your body. I mean, I guess it's okay, since he's a robot. It makes sense that he makes mechanical noises now. That sound means I'm feeling emotionally charged right now. I, I, I see. Y y your body makes noises based on your feelings. Okay. <laughs> Just now, I have activated a new function. Huh? A new function? Are you serious? Is it flight? Can you finally fly? Yeah. Now then, prepare yourself! It opened? Flavor Flav? A clock. You said Flavor of Love? Season 4? I sense the passage of time. I don't even need to look at clocks anymore. Whether it's training, meals, or bats. There's no doubt this feature is useful in a variety of situations. It actually comes out of your chest. What are you, cuckoo clock? What are you, cuckoo clock? Hold on. A cuckoo clock. Don't compare me with one of those everyday clocks. Gee. This is a highly efficient radio clock. Radio clock. Uh. It's a type of clock that receives radio signals so we can automatically update the time at fixed intervals. Simply put, it's an extremely accurate clock. Oh, that's right. It's a clock that will never slow down. It's even designed so that it cannot be adjusted. <laughs> now you've become a time lord! Man. Well, even if it's an accurate clock, they didn't need to install it inside your body. What? What are you saying? I don't need to wear a wristwatch ever again. There's nothing more useful than this. That Monokuma. He's definitely toying with people's bodies. Good instincts. Alright, let's take a look inside. Huh? It's locked. Ooh, baby! How exciting! A bunch of mice are pressed up against the other side of the door. Just thinking about it is too awful! Yeah. No, no! Not mice! Yeah. No! Anyway, looks like we can't go in there. I mean, we've seen everything there is to see here, right? And just like that, I'm gone. There's even a roller coaster here. Well, obviously, since it's an amusement park. Too bad! It's still under maintenance! The ride isn't intense enough yet, so I'm in the middle of powering it up like crazy! I don't think you need to do that. It's not like anyone's going to ride this anyway. Come on! No, now, don't say that! I also prepared a prize for you! You're planning to bait us with the prize? Again? Look forward to it! Okay. Anyway, please enjoy the other attractions first! I'll make sure I finish the maintenance by then! Sorry, y'all. I keep getting texts, bro. Like, for now, I should come back here after I've checked out the other areas. What am I gonna do? I should think about that when the time comes. Akane, what you doing here, guy? Yahoo! A roller coaster. Roller coasters are the only reason to go to amusement parks. There's nothing like a good thrill ride. All right. Apparently, it's still under maintenance, but I'll be first in line to ride it as soon as it's fixed. Lit. Oh yeah, still under maintenance. I guess just come back. Yeah, 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 Next up, next up, we got. Let's get it, man. 
Funhouse. Bro, I've been breaking out so bad. Got a pimple here, a pimple up here, a pimple. Alright. It's like a building out of a fairy tale. Minus the creepy looking train. I don't really understand this concept. What kind of attraction is this supposed to be? Where are we supposed to find clues about the future foundation in an amusement park? Hey. How about you? Did you find anything? Like your school profile, maybe? Haji's not hearing that shit. Like, right, right, bro. Be quiet. Quit trying to talk to me. Ah! Welcome to the fun house. Fun house. Yes, indeed. With this train I'm conducting, I shall take you all. I shall take you all to the fun house. Your body will be crushed asunder by then. Golly. Then there's no way I'm riding that thing. Rawr! You'd never be able to ride it anyway. Rawr! Rawr! Um... You know, in order to go to the fun house, all of you guys have to ride this train. All of us. So... If you want to try to go to the fun house, you gotta assemble everyone here. Nonetheless, your body will be crushed All right, you already said that. This obviously smells fishy. This is clearly a trap. I've decided I'm never going to ride this thing. Alright, I think it's time I head over to the roller coaster. Oh shit! Did we just see everything? Okay, so let me see again. It goes horror, right? Or is there something that we didn't see yet? Central Island, okay. Central Island, horror house, castle. Doggone roller coaster and fun house. It's a small little island. Ugh, we look so Yo. raggedy. Everybody here? Want me to tell you? Hey, wanna know something cool? According to Monokuma, we'll all get a treat if we ride that roller coaster together. Hey, hey! I I'm not riding that thing! Didn't I tell you? I get crazy car sick. Ah! Ah! Welcome! What? Welcome to the main attraction of this amusement park, the Great Ultra Delicious Coaster. Hey, hey! Is it really true that we'll get a prize for riding this? Of course! Excuse me. Sure thing! What's the prize? No way! Oh no! That's a surprise for you after you ride this! This is bad. Hey, do we really have to ride this together? What are you saying? Didn't I tell you already? Are those ears for decoration? Shut up! No! Shut up. I'm not gonna do it! <laughs> no, no, it's gonna be fine. Thrill rides are sweet. I already know. Everyone who likes them always says that! I already know they're not gonna be fun at all! Even so. But. There's a possibility that the prize is going to be those shit parts, you know? Uh, that, that might be true, but... Um... Might I ask, where will this ride take us? Nope. It won't take us anywhere. It's just going to circle around and come back here. Um, what is the meaning behind that? You fiend. Have you never gone to an amusement park? I am embarrassed to say that we do not have these in my country! Fine. I see. I've only gone to an amusement park once during my childhood. Listen well. But it was an amusement park in hell filled with man-eating demons! <gasps> there are amusement parks in hell? Yeah. I have never heard of such a thing. By all means, please allow me to accompany you next time. Hey, hey, hey! Don't do it, Miss Sonya! That guy has a habit of lying! Miss Sonya, did you just say you want to go to hell and ride roller coasters? Miss Sonya is just an adventurer, I get that, but some things you don't need to see. <laughs> the entrance fee is the blood of a virgin. I shall offer you up your blood as tribute. Sonya, who you been smashing down? He said, bust it open, Soniana. Are you kidding me? Look at, look at Soda. Look at Soda. Hurt, heart broke. 
Hey, it's just gonna be a waste of time if we stand around like this. See? Why don't we just try riding it? That's obviously oh, hey, hey, hey. Why, 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 why do we have to just try riding it? Like, <laughs> Nikamaru, can I leave this to you? Understood. I'm not even finna do that. I'm, my, my chest gonna start hurting if I scream that. Hey, 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 hey. Good work. But despite his desperate struggling, Kazushi got stuffed into the roller coaster. Now then. All aboard the great ultra delicious coaster. With Monokuma's shout, the roller coaster took off at maximum speed. Yahoo! You see who I'm sitting at? Wait, that's not even. Soda, we could have easily switched seats, bro. Look at the Kane still. Nekamaru had to get a whole section by himself to counterbalance the weight. Hajime, put your hands up! What overwhelming G force! It feels like all the screws in my body are gonna fly off! Bro, they are flying off. Look at you! Be still, my heart! Where are your dark divas of destruction at? This is so much fun! Oh, I'm gonna die! Let me die! Don't need to put your hands up! If you yo, if you ride in roller coasters but you don't put your hands up, you're wasting your time. Get active! Put your hands up! Put yes, your hands up! Alright, we arrived! How was it? Wasn't that fun? So, so it's finally over. That was a little too intense. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go on it one more time. Right. I agree! Once more! No. Hey, hey. hey, more importantly, where's our tree? Yes, indeed! Oh yeah, right! Here you go! The tree is a file! Huh? The symbol! Oh wow! It's the same symbol that's on the door of the ancient ruin! If so, this file must be a file from the future foundation! Will we be able to find out who they are if we look at this? Hey! Is it alright if I check inside? Sure thing! Do whatever you like. We gathered around Nagito as he as he received the file and stared at him intensely as he carefully turned the pages. Hope's Peak Academy ironically became the site for the killing school life. The mastermind behind the plan locked the students inside the academy and forced them to kill it. Oops. Oh, there we go. A little Less pressure on my back. The mastermind behind the plan locked the students inside the academy and forced them to kill each other. The students who were pushed to their limit eventually reached a state of heightened paranoia. And that's how the killing began. The killings committed by those students lasted several days, but at a certain point, the curtain suddenly fell. A group of students united and staged a counterattack against the mastermind. Who paid with their life? Ooh! Look at the picture. They talking about Dangan One. Whoa! Look at the look at the bottom left. We got Togami, it's Genocide, Kyoko, uh, Makoto, uh, Aoki, whatever her name is, Hina, and a homie Hero. A group of students united and staged a counterattack against the mastermind who paid with their life. Look, 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 y'all! With this, the six students who survived were able to escape the academy. Wait. Hey, aren't these photos on the left? Photos of the six people who survived? Then, what does this mean? Why is he in this photo? I looked down at where Nagito was pointing. <gasps> oh my god, I'm overthinking me soon to find out about Makoto, but you right! We read you right! He was much thinner, as if he was an entirely different. This is what we needed to bring the story back! 
we grabbed the story as it was fleeting from us and said, get over here. Let's go. He was much thinner, as if he was an entirely different person. But he looked exactly like someone we knew. The ultimate affluent progeny, Kuya Togami. He looked exactly like him, the first victim on this island. What? Th th this definitely looks like Briakuya. Impossible! Why is Briakuya's picture photo in here? This is... Th this... What, what does this mean? Hey, 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 like, hey, hey. what's this killing school trip that they're talking about? Yep. It looks like the killings were involved in... Resemble this set of killings that happened before. And that took place inside Hope's Peak Academy. Hey, bastard. Hold on. Did these fucked up killings actually happen inside the Hope's Peak Academy? That's obviously It's impossible. not possible. There's no way the teachers or the police would let that happen. Let me ask. However, what if the Future Foundation, World Ender, was the one who initiated this? What? You mean that organization was the one who took over Hope Speak Academy then? Of course not! Th th that's, that's not possible! How stupid! <sighs> if Kuya were still alive, we would have been able to learn the details of this. How unfortunate. However... We lost our memories, correct? That should have applied to Kuya as well. Also, Kuya never said a word about such a past actually existing. Let me tell you this. Well, he was killed before he could. So he became the first victim before he could tell us about any of this. Ah, oh, perhaps that's what Kuya was planning to talk to me about. I cannot talk to the others about my past. I suspect that my... <laughs> ah. Come on, come on. Was he specifically referring to this killing school life. Hey. Anyway, as long as Kuya is no longer with us, we have no choice but to ask Monokuma. How does the killing school life that occurred at Hope's Peak Academy relate to this island? Hey, um... The only thing I can say is... It's true. All the answers are in your school memories that were taken away. You? Then give them back! Give those memories back to us! No, no! The Future Foundation took your memories, and I can't do anything about it in my current state! Impossible! Regardless, it's unforgivable. I will never forgive those who try to trample hope. They should all be destroyed. Uh, Ugh, this isn't making sense again! How fucking annoying! Hey. Whatever, man, just let me go back home! Where the hell are those shit parts? Who knows? They should be somewhere on this island. However... I have searched this island once through, but I did not find ship parts anywhere. No. The funhouse should still be left. This too... Based on what I've heard. Consolidate. Be quiet. It seems we cannot access it unless we're all gathered together, correct? Correct! Correct! That's right! The treats you can't find yet are all hidden inside the funhouse. Then the ship parts should be there too, right? No, not just the ship parts. If he means all the treats, that also includes our Hope's Peak Academy student profiles. Which means a clue about my talent should be there too. It might be a trap. It might be a trap, but... But... It's like we're already caught in a trap. Then... Everyone. Let's go. Let's try going to the fun house. However... I see. Is that really alright? The fun house is that creepy looking building, right? But we have no other choice. I mean, we have... We might be able to obtain the ship parts if we go there. <laughs> and learn the secret of Hajime's talent too. Don't forget about me. I'm still watching you, nigga. Yep. Fine. I think we should listen to Hajime and head over to the funhouse as well. <laughs> Looks like you guys have decided. I can't wait! I can't wait! 
and I have things to prepare, so I'll be going first. I'll see you later. I'm not really on board with this idea, but if everyone says they're gonna go, I guess I have no choice. I guess I have to go with everyone. Chiaki, let me tell you like this. If you die before, if you die as the next trial, I'm not even gonna say what I'm gonna do because they're gonna dislike the video. I shall engulf this world. Plunging yourself into a trap is an act of sheer madness. <laughs> That's what makes it truly interesting. Then it's decided. Maybe it's because we were shown a new mystery from that Future Foundation file, but I was panicking. I couldn't keep still after being forced to see more mysteries that didn't make sense. I felt like I didn't even care if it was a trap. And because of that panic, I completely forgot. Monokuma's traps are always far beyond our imagination. I completely forgot about that. Nope, 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 no, no, no. This is the first, bro, this is the first time in a while that I've played Dangan Rompa 2 and been hype for the next episode. We gotta stop right here, bro. We gotta stop right here, bro. I'm telling you, this is finna be heat. I cannot wait to see what's up in there. But for now, we gotta rest. I know y'all need to go to bed. I know y'all need to go eat dinner, eat lunch. Y'all might be watching this in school. You probably just got detention. It was not worth it, bro. I'm gonna be right back tomorrow. You gonna get detention too tomorrow too? Like the video if you're gonna get to detention tomorrow too. And if you want this series to be continued, bro. Finally! Oh my gosh, what a rough chapter last time, but this one seems ha 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 hype! Love y'all. Subscribe if you are new. Turn on that bell so you know when I'm posting videos. Love each and every one of you, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace! Nekamara was back. Let's go, my boy.